There's a Talking Heads lyric. I've changed my hairstyle so many times now, I don't know what I look like. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. You know, uh, I think uh, many of us, uh, you know, many of us go through like life cycle changes where, you know, when you're young, you'll have a certain kind of hairstyle. And as you get older, perhaps you have a more conservative kind of hairstyle. Uh, not everyone follows that formula. I've seen some old guys, uh, some old dudes looking pretty wild and funky and, uh, and fun. Uh, not, not conservative by any means, but uh, the point is sometimes we have, uh, we, we go through these hair changes and appearance changes, beards and mustaches and, and hair and perm and dyeing our hair, or particularly as we get older, some people go into the dyeing the gray for a while until they finally have to give, give up that ghost. Uh, but, uh, but the point of this uh, discussion is, you know, maybe we should uh, just change our hair, change our, our appearance, change our, our, our style of clothing every once in a while, dramatically, uh, dramatically, uh, do like a serious like makeover and turn over and start over, or do over, do, do it different and, uh, and then watch your world. Watch what happens. Watch. Uh, it should be very interesting to, to see like how people respond to you. People will, res will definitely respond to you differently if you change your hair, you change your hairstyle, if you go to from, uh, from glasses to contacts, if you uh, grow a beard or a mustache or, 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 or get an earring or a nose ring or, or start wearing uh, bright, bold colors and pink sneakers, uh, you, 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 you makeup, who knows what. You do these things differently, people will respond to you differently. And it'll, it'll be interest, interesting to see their reactions if, they, if you, you changing makes them uncomfortable. Uh, maybe they'll say things that make you want to like go back to the wearing and looking the way you were. Uh, or maybe they'll be very supportive and, and, and excited about it. Maybe you'll be a role model to encourage them to be authentic and different and go for it. Uh, so you, you'll see your friends and acquaintances and strangers look at you funny, look at you differently, some admir admirably, maybe others with derision uh, and disdain, who knows. And then, then you can also look at yourself, look at how your self-esteem and how you react to the reactions of others. And how, you know, uh, how do you react to looking in the mirror? Uh, do you act differently because you look different? Uh, it's a fascinating experiment, and it, and it may, uh, I believe it will prove to be very valuable to you to do it just as an experiment. You may, may actually find out that you want to, you know, stay in that new mode. You don't have to. You could make a, you know, a, do a makeover thing and like two days later go back to the way you were and tell everybody it was a grand experiment, haha, -ha. and, uh, or, or you could stay with it for X amount of time and then shift gears again. But I think the shifting of gears is what I'm trying to tell you is that oftentimes we get into a rut. We get into a rut in our lives and you, you need to break out of the rut. And sometimes breaking out of the rut can be as simple as just doing something different, right? Yeah. Uh, doing something different, something observably different, and then seeing your reaction to it, seeing your uh, uh, other people's reaction to it, see the world's reaction to it, see how, how your life changes or, uh, or, or stays the same because of it. Have some fun with life. Mix it up a bit.